Let's hope the executioner hasn't remembered me. At least he didn't see me stealing from him, right? But he did see me trying to break into his house a couple of times. He may not actually give me a job because of that. That sounded like... Hello. The crying... What? Is there a crying woman? Why is that girl standing here crying? I executed her husband. Oh. What? That is his job, Henry. You killed him? No, no, not like that. It was done lawfully. She knew he had it coming. So then why... Folk would like to drive her out of town. She has no one here. For a while, I thought I could take care of her, but it wasn't to be. What? Why? Do you really have to ask? I can't even go to the tavern for company, and no one would sup their ale with me. Uh oh. And when I die, they'll probably push me into a hole with a stick so as not to touch my corpse. Is it really that bad? I'm not complaining, mind. It's a well-paid job. If you don't mind being a pariah. They might look sideways at you, too, just for talking to me. And that's what she's afraid of? Exactly. I had no idea. Thought executioner would have been a respected job. Does the crying girl have any family? Doesn't that crying girl have any kin? None she knows of, poor lass. You could help her, though, if you wanted. Me? How? Elishka has no family, but her husband might still have some kin... Nobody will talk to me, but you could find out more. Were you going to pay me? What do you want me to do about it? How can I find out if there's any family? Try asking Elishka herself. She knows a thing or two about them. But in the end, you'll still have to go and find out something from the bailiff or from the records at the rat house. Why do you care? Why do you want to find her family anyway? Don't you want her to stay here? I do. She's a splendid woman. But I'd never want to keep her here against her will. The life I lead isn't for everyone. All right. Fine. All right. I'll see what I can do. My thanks. If only for the thought. Mm-hmm. Where is this person? Okay. Hello. Um, Herman sent me. <laughs> what a way to end up. What did he do? <laughs> Don't despair. It could be a lot worse. Only death could be worse, and I'm not far from it. <laughs> Do I know what he's done? We don't know what he's done. He might have deserved this. Can I ask about your family? Can I... We have a weird thing to ask. Can I ask about your family? <laughs> what do you want to know? No? <laughs> That's the first thing I'd bring up before I'd ease my way into it. Do you have any relatives? Don't you have any kin left? Someone who'd take you in? No. They all died of the plague. <laughs> and then I ended up with that man of mine. I always knew he'd get strung up one day. <laughs> so then you should have expected this, right? What about your husband's family? Didn't your husband have any kin? Maybe. He mentioned some, but we never went to see them. Is that all you know? Yes. But if they're anything like my old man, the bailiff and his catchpoles will know about them. Sure. I'm on good terms with the bailiff. You'll find out what this guy did, as well as finding out if he has any family you can stay with. That's all I need. Ooh, and that guy is outside the castle again. See if we can pickpocket him before going inside to the bailiff. I'm not quite sure why it didn't work before. Was it the wrong ring that I found? Kill me. Come here, green and yellow trousers. Right, pickpocket. It's turning red already. Oh, I've gone the wrong way. No, it's a dice. Successful, though. If I mean, if I keep pickpocketing him in th his things, how many more stuff is he going to have in his pockets? Like, it should be less options to choose from, right? Surely. Okay. Uh, this one? No, it's a dice. No, it's coins. No, it's a key. Nope. Sake. I get less time there. Do these change? No, it's coins. That's fucking sausage, isn't it? He actually stops there for me to pickpocket. That's not a good sign, is it? Is someone on about? Is someone in the bar's gonna see this? Where's he going? Nope, that's the sausage. Nope, that's the key. 
No, it was a dice. <laughs> they, see, they keep to changing places, right? They're not in the same place. Okay, come on. Key. Key. Money. There's the ring. But I can't get out in time, right? I can't get... I don't understand. I need it to be like in one of the doors right next to the door. Like the leaving door. Do I need to be better at pickpocketing? Maybe. Like it needs to be in, like in here. No? There it is. See, I can't... I can't get it. Did I get it? I don't think so. Yeah, I must be doing it wrong. Press the help button. Help. Yeah, I know this bit. Next page. Uh, oh. Oh, okay. I need to press E on the on the thing. That's how you do it. Okay. So like here, I'd have to do that and then do that. Right. Right. Okay. Shit, I could have already done it by now. Key. No. Key. Oh, okay, I'll take the key. It's pill for all his pockets. I'm gonna run out of time though. There's gonna be a guard up there soon. Oh, it's really annoying. Now I know what to do. I feel like when I practiced, I didn't do that. On Peshek. There it is. Bam! Got it. Nice. Where's this go? Who wants this? I've forgotten. The poor man, right? This guy, yeah. Good day to you. What do you need? It's what I can do for you. I have the ring. I've got that ring. Ha! That'll bring tears of joy to that poor widow. I hope you filled your own pocket while you were at it. Uh, um, You're a handy lad. Yeah, I didn't. The king of all the thieves in Ratai. Maybe should have. Just didn't think about taking everything he had. <laughs> I mean, I would have got a lot more stuff if I knew how to have done it properly. You've got more stuff, have you? What else have you got for me? Something really special this time. There's a stuck-up cloth merchant from Ladechko who comes to Ratai from time to time. The bastard claims poverty is God's punishment on us for our sins. I'd like to show him what God's punishment looks like. Now, if you were to lift his gill seal from his pouch, he'd never live down the shame of losing it once the guild gets wind of it. The mills of God grind slowly but surely, eh? And we'll help them along. As a reward, I'd get you something really wonderful. Just wait and see. Sure. I'm on it. Very well. Guild seal from some merchant. Where is he? Is he in town? No. This guy's miles away. Alright. Okay, on to the bailiff. Wait. Wait. Bailiff. Behind you. Hello? Talk? I'm honored that a knight such as you takes an interest in me. Ah, so I've got more like uh, reputation than the bailiff. I have fight. If I'm impressing the bailiff. Elishka, that's who I'm here for. Why did you hang her husband? And does she have any family? Do you know Elishka? The wife of the man who was hanged recently. The one that's with the executioner now. That's her. Oh, life can be cruel sometimes. Um. Right. And do you know if she has kinfolk somewhere around? How should I know? Now, if you don't mind, I'm very busy. Wow, my crowns is one? Wow. I guess it's because I'm in, like, in full armour. Is it? We're going to have to go for speech, then. You have one less thing to deal with, if you tell me. I'll sort it out for you. If Eliska stays with the executioner, it'll end up being your problem anyway. Christ, oh, all right, then. Tell the scribe. Tell the scribe what? Wait, who? Where can I find him? He's suffering with some ailment, so no doubt he'll be lying in his chambers above his study, on the top floor of the rat house. Alright, is this the guy who caught me before, trying to go through the chest? This is the rat house, right? Yeah. He's asleep. Can't pick pocket hard. Lock pick hard, I mean. Hello? Jesus Christ be praised. No, I can't wake you up. Elishka, do you know her family? I'd like to ask if... 
Ah, this knee of mine hurts like hell. Um, I'd like to ask... Young man, young man, there's always someone who wants to ask something. What do you need? I wondered if you could take a look in your books for me, and, uh... Books? You'll let me finish. God above, am I to shuffle around here with my knees the way they are? Oh, I've got to do something for you, have I, as well? The bailiff sent me here. I'm not doing ointment. I'm not getting healing stuff for you. I'm on official business. The bailiff sent me. That's another matter, then. What do you need, friend? There we go. Records. Is it possible to find out from the records where someone lives? You think we keep records of every serf? For Christ's sake, they breed like rabbits. But but I thought that in the rat house, though, in, in, in the books... Boy, the books are for recording pacts, undertakings, punishments, property rights, and so forth. In other words, important things. We don't keep records of serfs. Eliska won't be happy about that. Eliska? You don't mean the one who married into the Mishek family? Yes. Yes, you know her. Why wouldn't I? I used to play dice with old Mishek years ago. Is this the husband, then? He had a son. A nice, polite lad. How is he? I don't know. Tied up? I, I don't... Is it... Who's, who got hung? I guess this is the guy who got hung. Oh, uh, you know, he's, he's <laughs> quite tied up these days. Well, if you see him, tell him to swing by. Well. And where are the Mishaks living now? A stone's throw from Rate by the small fish pond. Thanks. All right. Am I going to get... I better fucking get sand out of all this. Just doing this out of the goodness of my heart. Where, where's this? All right, that's not fine. I could do that now. Okay. So this is the family's house. Some guy there. But wants me to go over here? To the woman of the house, elderly woman. What are you here for? Oh my god. You okay? <laughs> Looks a bit rough. I have news about Eliska. I've got information about your daughter in law. <laughs> uh, Eliska's fine, only she needs. Never heard of her. Get lost. Do you... Oh, they've disowned her. She's your kid. I mean, she's not. I mean, is she? I don't know. Daughter in law? It's not the same, is it? She's your nearest kin. Eliska's part of your family, and she really needs you. I won't help anyone. Old hag. <laughs> Listen, you old hag. If you interrupt me one more time... Fuck up! Ugh. I could make it worth you or not. I'm not giving her money. Is that the only way to, to do this? I could make it worth your while. Oh, God, that's... Why? I don't want to make it worth her world. What is it now? I can make it worth your while somehow. Do you, do you want to have sex? I could make it worth your while. Really? You want me to plow you? And what is it you want? Your son's widow needs help. She has nowhere to go. What do I care about some useless girl? I don't know why I care, to be honest. Yeah, a fire could be dangerous. I could set fire to your house. With an attitude like that, you must be popular around here. I wonder how quick your neighbours would be to help you if you needed it. I wonder what they'd do if your house should happen to catch fire. What the... <laughs> And if you happen by chance to be locked inside. Nice, Henry. What? Oh, foul. Oh, come on. Shall I go and get my pitchfork? That looked good. That sounded so good. Why did that not work? She has nine of the swords. I have 11. Why did that not work? I don't get that. What's the point of it then? I don't understand. Do the speech then. She could help you with the farm. She definitely knows how to take care of things. This is higher as well. We're Why is it a foul? We're right our own. We don't need another mouth to feed. Well, it's the same, actually, right? It's the same. That plus one means it's... I don't understand why that didn't work, the fire. Don't get that. Well, I don't want to give you money. I don't... No, I'm not giving you fucking money. Oh, to hell with it, then. Yeah, if not, fuck you. You're not going to help. I don't care. Get lost. Is that it? Do I have to bribe her to do the quest? Is there someone else here I can talk to? Persuade them instead. Who's this? Elderly man. Get lost, or I'll give you up for it. Fuck me, these guys. They're, I mean, would you want to stay here with these people? Can I set fire to the house? <laughs> Can you do that? Where's my torch? How'd you do it? Can you set fire? No, that's my fist. Can I just set fire to the hatch?
fire's sake. Why can't I set fire? Ugh. Well, I don't want it clogging up my quest space. <laughs> How much is the bribe? How much to pay? And then maybe I can steal from them. Where, where is she? To get it back. How much? Is it, uh, it's not, oh, fucking hell. Jesus, really? Fine. That's really, that's nothing. That's no bother to me. There you go, 60 coins. Are we agreed. Come now, just a little more and we have a deal. I'm going to get this money back from your house, just so you know. You took the words out of my mouth. I'm going to steal everything from you. Send her here then. But don't let her think she'll be taking it easy. What the hell is wrong she'll with your have hair? her work cut out. I don't care. That sounds quite... And if I hear a peep out of her, I'll take a stick to her back. Okay, good for what you. salvation this is. Oh. Hey. What was I doing? I was just sniffing your bum. Okay. Another key. Oh, I'm not gonna have time to. <gasps> okay, and the, the last thing must be the money, right? Surely. Get my money back. How much was that? It doesn't say. It doesn't say. I can't tell you how much it was. But that must have been all my money back, surely. Like, what has she done with the money I just gave her? Alright. Got some keys. Can we go in here? No. See what else you got, I can rob. Since I can't set fire to your house. I mean, these are horrible people anyway. <laughs> Loud in? Anyone home? Where did the elderly man go? Alright, I have the keys for a chest. Where's the chest? Chest, chest, chest. Chest, chest, chest. Or was it for a door? Maybe for a door. Okay. Trespassing. Oh no. Anything, 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 anything of note? Why is this locked? What's in here? Wine? No, not wine. It's all just provisions and shite. Why is this lo It's just the. There's like shitty pantry, right? I don't think they have anything to rob. This is the problem, right? You can't really steal from poor people. They don't have anything. <laughs> Need to find more rich people. Okay, chest. Uh. That's all crap. That's crap. I don't want that. I don't want it. It's rubbish. It's just clothes. It's your wardrobe. Disappointing. Let's go back to retire. Or the executioner, right? I guess. Alright, I found uh, some family. Not sure you're going to like them. Good evening. Yeah, hello. You've stopped crying. You're not crying now? I'm not. I've wept enough for a lifetime. Really? It's a bit of a change since my last visit. I haven't had much luck in my life, but I've always worked things out in the end. Tears are no help to anything. That's true. It's not even been a day. So <laughs> did you find out something about them? I did. I found your husband's father and mother, and uh, they're willing to take you in. But... That's one way of saying it. They're a bunch of cunts. They're, um... They're not very nice people, Elishka. They probably work you to the bone. But you would get fed. Life is never easy. But at least I'd have a family. Sure. Go. Go on. Go to them. Go be friends. Have fun. With your horrible stepmother and father. I don't care. That's true. You'll have a roof over your head and uh, work to keep you busy. I'll survive. I survived worse things. Ciao. I'm sorry I couldn't arrange anything better. No doubt it's God's will. Can I have some money? Thank you, Henry. Take care. Can you pay me for helping you? Herman, I... Yes? Ooh. Farewell. A cutscene. And thank you for everything. <laughs> no need to thank me. I'm glad I had a chance to get to know you. Promise me... You'll take care of yourself. You deserve a better life. She moved on already. I just... From her husband. Promise me. Fancies the man I who promise. killed him? <laughs> oh well, Alishka. That's fucked up. 
I guess I could have talked to him to take her in, but I don't want to do that. I want to send her to the horrible family. All right, mate, where you going? Just lock me inside your like kitchen. Can I have something for my troubles, Herman? Oh, alright. Guess he wants to be alone. Sure, it works by me. Did you keep anything in here? No. I, I, I mean, I already sort of know the layout of this place, right? There's a chest here, that's it. I think I already stole from him. Yeah, there's nothing in there. They're poor people, they just, they just have nothing. Alright, what the fuck am I doing now? There's a couple of things to do, right? Activity giver, quest giver. Let's just see what these things are. Who? The pig? Who does he want me to talk to here? Someone- oh, someone asleep over there. Can I wake you up? Alex? Do I know Alex? Uh, Wait, he's- uh, he was the guy who let me sleep. was in charge of sending people to work from skillets, right? What's, what can I do with him? Let's wait for him to wake up. God be with you. Yeah, hi. Can I do something else with you? How are the refugees doing that are carrying water? Is that what I can ask for? Do they have got the job yet, or do I have to wait until I sort the cook out? How are you coping? As well as we can, Henry. You can be glad Sir Radzik took you into his service. I hear you even go hunting with Lord Capon. Once. I've been once. And I don't think it'll be happening again any time soon. Ah, it's a shame. Because I was going to ask right. a favour of you. What? I'm sure you know there's a lot of hungry mouths here, so I thought... You might be able to help. I can't feed the homeless. What? I don't know. I'm not such a great hunter that I could feed all the refugees. No, no, that's not what I meant. It's the townspeople here who have a taste for game. They want to live like the nobility, see? A few of the burghers have been to see me already. To ask if we'd try our luck in the woods. They promised us supplies in exchange. Flour, lard, eggs, and the like. But we can't afford to take the risk of poaching. We're barely tolerated as it is. If one of ours got caught in the woods, they'd hang him from the nearest tree. But I was thinking, you! You're in Sir Radzik's garrison and you go hunting with Sir Hans. You could help us. Okay. Well, I got away with brawling with Laura Capon, so I don't suppose they'll string me up for a few hairs. Great, Henry. I really appreciate it. Am I not allowed to hunt? The local tailor was asking me about getting some hairs to put on a feast for a visiting merchant. All right. I'll bring you something. Thank you. You'll be saving us from starvation. No. Are you not allowed to hunt unless you've been given permission? No? Is that how it works? Seven to... Oh, I, I did store some in a chest, right? Like where we went hunting last time. Do you think it's still there? Where was that? Where was that? Well, it's probably all spoiled though, right? That's not how it works, is it? Alright. Well, I'll, I'll keep that in mind. There, there was someone here as well. Let's see what this is. Right, am I I got told off before going in here. Am I allowed in here? Yeah. Hello, can I come in? Is that okay? It's it's locked. Is it is it the guy I'm in, in there that I need to talk to? Can I wait? Maybe maybe he's just like asleep. What's the time? It's, it must still be asleep. Maybe it's like Hainish? Does he sleep here or in the other place? Or maybe it's Radzik, right? Maybe he's... Ah, oh, Radzik got left this place, right? It's probably Radzik. It's not like upstairs in the battlements, no? Oh, Maybe? Maybe he's up here? What's in here? Yes. Oh, is it... Oh, it's Capon. Oh, are you okay now? The Lord be praised. What brings you to me? Are you all healed up, are you? How goes it, sir? Are you recovered? I am! For all the good it does. Wanna go hunting? The boredom here! The only thing I have to read is the Bible! And the Hanush won't let anyone near me but the priest! Have you any idea the monotonous drivel that fella comes out with? This world is but a trial. Be repentant! He talks to me as if I'm about to breathe my last. Actually, talks to me as if I were already dead. Listen, Henry, won't you come with me to the Rate Baths? I need a change of scene before moss starts growing on me. Sure, we can go to the bars if you like. Are your wounds okay now? But what about your wounds, sir? Well, I won't lie to you, it hurts like the devil. 
but I'd rather hobble along with a cane, howling in pain, than listen to a selection of the most boring passages from the Gospels for one more minute. Sure, let's go. I'll meet you there. Why not? When do you want to go? I shall go there right away, but wait until at least dusk to join me. I'll have company there. Ooh. All right, I'll come and join you there. Shall I bring a date? Is this a, a double date? Shall I bring Teresa? Courtliness. What the hell is it? Courtly etiquette. Hmm. Look at all this stuff. I'm not reading all this shit. All, all this like law things you learn. I ain't reading all this crap. We we learn as we like interact with the world about about things and stuff. Don't need to like read about like who the Pope is and shits like that. So we can just wait until then. I mean, I could also uh, talk to that man who wants the hairs for the beggar's feast, just to see maybe he has any good locations I could do some hunting or maybe gives me a bow or, or just maybe something. And how are we supposed to live in the meantime? On dirt and air? It's not that bad. Not that bad? I woke up with a rat in my blanket. A rat. I thought you guys were like tied up as punishment. Why were you standing back to back? <laughs> I thought you'd been naughty. Right, what where, where is this? Is this... Hello? What? Oh, I know you. Yeah, how goes the water carrying? Are you doing that? Good day to you. Did I give him the job to do that or not? There's still something I want to ask you. Oh, yes. I'm still interview people, but... Okay, so I do need to still wait to get... That's enough for now. ...the cook for this Good stuff to happen. You. Get all their, like, rewards and stuff. Okay. Is someone there? Yeah, am I not allowed to be here? I'm, I'm here to talk to someone. Hello? Am I in the right place? I'm here to talk about some rabbits. No? Is he on the wall? Where? Hello? Oh no, this is Alex. It's telling me to go. Oh, I thought. Oh, what's he doing over here? I was confused. Sorry, Alex. I, I thought I was um, talking to someone else about delivering hairs. Alright, so let's just wait until. Evening and do some bathing. How many? Not that many graves really here. I mean, they're not very nice though either, aren't they? They're quite shallow. No, these graves. When is dusk? Nine o'clock. I got. I'll do eight. Then we can have like an hour's time to walk to the bus. Okay, his horse is here, so he must be here. Right. Is, it, is this where you park your horses, just right in front of the gate? <laughs> He's a bit of an entitled douchebag, isn't it? That's kind of sort of like um, someone just parking in the disabled bay, right? <laughs> We're just parking right in front of the doors of the A and E. You guys got any food? Are you cooking up food? Where is it? Where is he? Is he in here? Hello. Here I am, sir. Who's there? Is this? Is that you? Who are you? Is that who I'm after? Hello? Laura Capon. Come after the door. Okay, sorry. I'll, wait. I'll just wait by your door for like an hour. Is that okay? You stand. Like someone stood by your front door for like an hour. Until they knocked. <laughs> Here I am, sir. Are you decent? What's it to be? Are you bu busy? Are you? are you still going at it with, with a whore? Mate, what do you want? Who is it? Am I in the wrong... Sorry, am I like intruding? Is it through here I'm meant to go? No? Right. Hello. Oh, you have your own little private bath, do you? Do you need anything? Do you want a happy ending, do you? What do you need, sir? I need you to do me a favour, Henry. Uh-huh. Again? What, again? Now, what's your tone, peasant? Well, you never think it. But Zdena here is a demon at dice. Oh, okay. She stripped me bare ass naked and I couldn't even get a ribbon off her. Let's strip her, then. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'll rip everything off her, then, eh? Good God! You do that to such a fragile flower? Who I paid for, by the way. Right then, you've got to beat Zdena at dice. 
I refuse to be the only one here with his arse on the show. Sure, play strip the ass. Okay. All right. Why the hell not? I've got loads of clothes on. I've got loads of layers. So, how does that actually work with with dice? Where do we do this? You want to play dice? Dice? Strip dice? Shall we play dice? How about a game of dice then? Are you sure? What would I do with two naked men here? Oh, who knows? <laughs> Let's see how good you are. God bless. Uh huh. Where do we? Play? I've forgotten how to play. How do we play this again? The co wait, what happened to my lucky die? Wait, is it this one? Where would we want to use the die of misfortune? Okay, confirm. Does it use up Safe the dice? Is it like a one-time use thing? Hand. I've forgotten how to play this game. It's sort of like poker, right? I don't need to read the instructions again. I'll figure it out. So we can hold... Like, last time I got a bit greedy, didn't I? This is out of 1400. Last time was 2000. I um, re-rolled more than I should have, right? So two ones is the 200, right? So we can keep those. And also two... One, two, th does one, two, three? Is one, two, three one or not? Right. I think five is like 50 on its own as well, right? And these don't do anything. These won't do anything, right? Got five, six, there's no four, right? So, uh, score and pass, right? We should score and pass. It seems there's method in your madness. Don't gamble. Just take what we get. Oh, are you fucking kidding me? That's just bollocks. You haven't exactly gone off to a good start, have you? <laughs> That's bollocks. What clothes have I removed? She's cheating. Whoa, she just got straight on the first fucking hand. All right, we're going again. What did I take off? We'll see whose side Lady Luck is on. Yeah, I feel like you've got loaded dice, haven't you? All right, what, what's, what have we got? One. There's no twos. They're, just one is 100, though, right? So we've got two sixes. Do you have to have three sixes, do you? Can't have twos. No. Right, yeah, that's that's right, is it? Okay, so we do re-roll on this one. Because it's not, why would we just keep a hundred, right? That'd be silly, right? Right? Yeah. Score and roll. Yeah, because we got some more stuff. Okay, nice. So we've got uh, 100 and uh, 200, these ones. And uh, we will score and pass. Bad move! Bad? But I'm proud of you anyway. I swear to God, if you get like 1400. That's it. Alright. Hmm. You're just gonna keep getting fucking ones? Okay. Right. Why didn't she take she didn't take the other five? You're gonna you're pushing it a bit, aren't you? You lucky bastard. We'll see. You're still going? No. No. No, she's got loaded dice. Get lost. Get out. If I did that, it wouldn't happen. Okay. I don't even know what my loaded dice are really doing, to be honest. So I've got two ones, sure. Uh, and a five. I'm just going to take those and score. Score and pass. Well, well, I wasn't expecting that. She's this got three. She one. had three twos there. Why did? Why would she not take the three twos? That's it. It's like three hundred, isn't it? How does it work? I've forgotten. Or 600? Is it? I can't remember where it scores. <sighs> I think it's like two... Would it be two times 100? So would it just be 200? Finished. I think. 750 is that. All right. I will remove your clothes, whoever you are. I've forgotten your name. Look at these sixes. See how much, see how much is this? 600? Yeah. It's, it's six times 100. All right. Okay. And, and I'll take... I take the one and the five as well. That's that's nice. I won. I've won, right? Score and pass. Is that fourteen? It oh, thirteen hundred. There's method in your madness. We'll see. 
Well, I don't understand why you'd re-roll that. Not take the row. Oh. It's her we want to strip, <laughs> not you. Have I lost? I lost both games. I lost both. Am I like completely naked? What am I wearing? I had so much more clothes though. Like we don't just remove one piece of clothing. God damn! I'm sorry, hands. I failed you. I could do with a good soak too. Then strip off and hop in here. Two guys in a bath. It's not that big, is it? We're gonna like cross legs. <laughs> sure. All right. Why not? Put your clothes in the trunk. I mean, you're wearing clothes, though. I'm getting dressed or getting naked. Okay, let's get naked. i got nothing to worry about. Nothing to be ashamed of. Like, that's not naked anyway, is it? I don't want to tread on anything vital. All right, give me a moment and I'll roll it up again. <laughs> <laughs> Which is good, to be honest, because uh, I'd have to blow it out. <laughs> Feels good. Yeah, don't take this personally. But I've never seen a man more in need of a wash. Well, I am a peasant. I've known cow pats less fragrant. <laughs> <laughs> so are we going to double tag this woman or not? I guess we could have if um, I hadn't lost. <laughs> you certainly know how to have a good time. Here, drink. It's not terribly high quality, but it should do the job. Don't mind if I do. I don't mind if I do. Give me that. That's the spirit. Not the bath water, right? So this is how you recuperate from your injuries? Booze and wenches? Of course! Is there any other way? So, what news, Henry? Never mind about me. What about you? Have you recovered from our hunting adventure? I'm well enough, Henry. These baths are just the thing, and Zdena here is very... Healing. We're not washing our armpits with our shirt on. Has it glitched out? Did I tick a box to say don't show nudity? This is weird, Clara, no? Clara, bring some wine for the gents before they get cross. I'm getting out. Am I done? You know what, Henry? What? We really can't drink this local piss. No? You want to go to the bar? Do you want to go to the bar? We're not going to get Clara, assassinated, right? With this bar Hello? The wine you have here. Okay. Something else is bothering you? What's wrong with the bathhouse wine? I'd rather drink the bath water. You should go and get something better. Though, where? Ah! I know! In the cellars under the rat's house, there's some excellent wine that Sahanish bought for us. And you want me to go there and get it now? I'd be indebted to you. And a grateful nobleman is the best ally you can have. I mean, this guy is quite powerful, right? He's going to be the new lord of this place. And we're getting in quite good chummy friends with him, sure. All right, then. What kind of wine is it? A silver red. In the cellar under the rat house. It's the last barrel at the end on the right-hand side. Get a picture somewhere and take it with you. Okay. Can I just take it? Or is it stealing? All right, then. I'll bring it. Good, man. Either way, no problem. My clothes? Can I put them back on? I don't know what this means. Can't speak 81. What, I don't know what that means. Let's just put all my clothes back on. Can't go outside naked, right? I'll be back in a jiffy. Is there a picture in here? Can I take a picture? Can I take one of these pictures? So hands, Capon's keys. Yeah, I should take that with me. I don't have to pick the lock. Uh, good job I looked in there, wouldn't it? Alright, how do I get into the cellar? I've not seen a cellar here before. One of the doors is going to say unlocked rather than... Rather than locked. In here. Downstairs, here we go. Hi guys. Don't mind me going in here, right? No, this is jails. Oh no, these are cells. Sorry. Ah, unlock! Right, and it's like, what's the point in taking the fucking keys if I can't use them? Okay. I have to go upstairs to go down. Maybe turn the light off. I, but then I can't see anything. <laughs> this 
this door? Okay. 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 What? Hello. Oh no. Hey, you. What are you doing here? Uh. Well, can I just not just tell the truth? I'm going to get wine for Capon. Lord Capon sent me to get some wine for him. Lord Capon, eh? A likely story. None of these ever work on the guards, right? I could try and bully him. I don't think it will work. I think the speech will probably be better. I'm his servant. Or I can show... Oh, yeah, just show him the key. Won't that work? Won't that work for just showing the key? I'm going to try one of these first. You clearly don't know Laura Capon. Do you think he's going to leave in the middle of his merriment to go and get his own wine? <laughs> there we go. No, that doesn't sound like the young lord. I suppose he sent you for the Sylvan Red. Indeed. Very one. Well, you'll leave some for Sir Hanush at least, won't you? <laughs> I'll try. I mean, maybe if I showed him the keys, that that would have been okay. It's just when normally when those options come up, I'm a bit worried that that's sort of like if you can't pass anything else, so it's not going to work. But I guess if I pickpocketed my way in, if I lockpicketed my way in without using the keys, then that option wouldn't have been there. And then I'd have to use the speech checks instead. I don't know. Right, which one is it? The one, you said the one at the back, right? Was it that one? Did I do it? Yeah. All right. I've been a couple of hours, I think. <laughs> I hope he's okay waiting. How do I leave? What's that noise? It's me, I'm just leaving. Relax. Stop right there. I have to search you. Why? Get I ain't got anything. What's going on? For security. Yeah, yeah, get on with it. Search me. Go ahead. As you wish. Are you yanking my pistol? And over all the stolen goods Wait. you have. I'll be keeping an eye Oh, wait, I have pick I did pick pocket now, a few people, didn't I? <laughs> that can't be the wire he's taken, right? I think that was because I pick put it a, a few. Right, I still got the wire. Those times. Yeah. What the hell did he take? What even did I? What did I take? It must have just been keys. Ain't taking like the money I stole from people, has he? Like it annoys me that it doesn't tell you the things. Like why doesn't it come up to say, like the the, the number of coins I stole and the number of things that have been taken from me? Why doesn't it tell me? I've got to, like try and figure it out myself. Knock knock. I got your wine. You still here? Yep. This has surely gone cold by now. So about that wine you sent me for. Well, have you got it? Aye. Of course. You really broke into the cellar at the rat house? I certainly did. I hope that wine's really worth the trouble I had. I don't believe it. You really broke into the cellar. You're insane. I mean, I used your keys. Nothing to it. I just used your key. My key? Why, you sly rogue, you. You're craftier than I thought. You can keep the key. They let me in there whenever I want anyway. Well, let's see if this wine is as good as you say. What are you waiting for? The parish priest's blessing? Come on then, get it down you. Ah, now that's what I call a real wine. Silver red. It's not like that donkey's piss they serve in this otherwise delightful establishment. You can tell from the first sip, can't you, Henry? Sure. Yeah, as you say, sir. Sylvan red. The taste is unmistakable. Wine well, all tastes the same to me. I knew we were forming a bromance with this guy. You want to get in the bath? There's a bit of a sausage fest in here. Ooh. Is this not like sort of playing around with a loaded gun when you're drunk? <laughs> Amazing. I am so hilarious. Henry, wow. So funny. <laughs> to, to be fair, when I was younger, getting pissed off to find a traffic cone, I'd stick it on my head, so... <laughs> okay, cool. Farting in the bath, sure. Believe Bob, sir, Hans. I'm not like the other girls. I know, Clara. 
You you are a different. <laughs> you, you deserve more. Mm. You deserve flowers. <laughs> what? You, what? What kind of? Uh, I'm not getting flowers. Flowers? Do you like? Ah uh, well, I like all kinds. I like dandelions, uh. sage, not weed, and poppies. I really like poppies. Oh, Henry, I'm not getting poppies. That? What? I'm too drunk. The lady requests da dandelions, mm -hmm. uh, uh, s sage, mm -hmm. uh, cabbages. <laughs> Right. <laughs> no, no, not weed and poppies. <laughs> what? You, you want me to go flower picking now? I know, I know. I'm putting you to work again. But if you do it, I'll give you what? Grivenzi Flavin Groschen. <laughs> what does that even mean? <laughs> that much. <laughs> All right, I'll go. What time is it? It's really quite weird. I've gone in there. With, I'm sure I've not ticked a box to say no nudity, even though it's good. It is done it. Something else. Should I just come back with a bit of light cabbages? Yeah. What would a bouquet be without roses? There's some in the upper castle garden. Up castle garden. Oh, God, I'm stealing from the fucking castle garden now, am I? All right. Sure. <laughs> okay, what's the time? Like half one? Sure. Let's fast travel up here. Ah. Through here? Okay. No? This doesn't look very gardeny, does it? It's more promising than being in the courtyard. Oh no. Like vegetable patches and stuff? Okay, this might be it. No one saw me do it. Okay. Is that all I needed? No? What else do I need? Do I need anything else? Poppies? Is that it? Roses and poppies? No? What else have we got? What else is here? What else does she want? There's nothing else here. Oh, more puppies. Is that enough? No? Oh, dandelions. The last dandelion. No? Sage. All right, say then there's something else as well, right? There's some other timber weed. Or, oh no, is that it? Have I been caught? Well, if I if I haven't been, I'm going to be now walking out with all these. I'm what the hell are oh. you doing here? I'd like some privacy if you don't mind. Come for my wench. Well, as you can see, I'm not your wench or anyone else's. So fuck off. What are you doing with my Clara, you cunt? Archie, stop that. He's just bathing here. Bathing here, is he? When all the wenches but you are whores. Archie. And are you whoring now, too? That's enough, Archibald. <laughs> Archibald? <laughs> <laughs> Shut your mouth. I'm not done with you. No, I swear the gentleman hasn't touched me. Actually, that's quite true. Um, well, mostly. No, nothing happened. Nothing. We can talk about this later. First, I'm dealing with this bastard. I'd like to see you try arson. Do you know who he is? This this is a very bad idea on your part, eh? Hey? Arson balls! <laughs> For the love of God, stop it, both of you! Fuck it out. He's actually trying to drown. Is he actually trying to drown him? Hey. What do you think you're doing? <laughs> oh! This guy, he, he's going straight to jail. Oh, oh, I'm in a fight. I'm drunk. This is going to be bad. Give up. Me give up. You give up. If you lose, you should be ashamed. I can't see. No, can I get a light? Get a light? No. Can't get a light. Alright, it seems pretty simple. I'm not really doing anything. I'm still beating him. Oh. Where's he going? Can't weaken the knee. 
What was, that, what was that technique you were using just then? To confuse me? Yeah, I'm doing it. So I think that little purple bar next to my health is their health. What the hell got into you? Trying to drown a nobleman. You're an idiot. Oh, shit. Fuck. You don't recognize him? I, I didn't know. Get out of my sights. Go on before I remember I can have you hung. I apologize, your lordship. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Archie, wait! I mean, I guess oh. there's no, like, TV or anything, right? Whew. I nearly got drowned by arson balls. <laughs> <laughs> so if you've not actually seen him in the flesh, you won't know who he is? Oh. That's the least relaxing bath I've ever had. Fuck, I feel like I've swallowed the Baltic. Oh. Drinking will be the death of you. Damn right. Is there any wine left? Are you out of your fucking mind? You want to carry on? Of course! Well, don't tell me you don't fancy a drink after all that. I think that's a yes. Oh, oh, where, where am I? Where have I ended up? Hello? Oh, I'm just in the, outside the bathhouse. Is he still here? Hello? Yo, this, this, it's really annoying you can't interact with them when they're opening and closing doors. So Hans. Nope, I've got the wash bowl. We're going to do about Archibald. And what will you do with them, Sir Hans? <laughs> what, with our symbols? I don't know. Oh. What do you think I should do with Put them? Put him in the stocks. Punish him. You're asking me what you should do with the lunatic who tried to drown you? Well... He was a bit drunk and jealous. No excuse. And he tried to kill you. And then me. It's your decision. But if word gets round that Lord Capon let an insult like that go unpunished, um... I suppose you're right. Yes. Well, a day in a stop's never killed anyone. Yes. Might do him good. Yes. <laughs> we can throw stuff in. Well, we had some pretty good sport, eh? Hey? See you later. But you gave me 75 coins for just hanging out with him. <laughs> Nice. Alright, well, that's uh, all of the things we know of to do in here. And we've got some on ground things to do that lead us outside, but there's nothing new to do. Might bring Alex and hers is one thing I've got on. So, uh, where, where would I go next? Could go to the band. It's next, it's closest, right? To the to west there. Like this way. Good try. Could try that. Yeah, maybe, maybe. There's a couple of things here to the west we could try before going sort of this way instead. Possibly. Okay. 